friends you're welcome to my channel it's a girl christy today we will be making cocoa body butter so without wasting much of your time let's dive into the video our first ingredient is our santing gum which helps stabilize emotions Our next ingredient is our vegetable glycerin, which is a infective humectant and also a moisturizer. Our next ingredient is our emollient, which helps soften the skin by preventing water loss. They are used in a wide range of cosmetics, e.g. lotion, creams, lipstick, conditioner, and body butter. Next is our emulsifying wax. Emulsifying wax refers to any ingredient that helps to keep unlike substance such as oil and water from separating. Combine the vegetable glycerin and the scenting gum together and set aside. If you like this video do not forget to subscribe mix well do not forget to give this video a thumbs up Our next ingredient is our distilled water. Please do not use bottled water or tap water. Add the mixed santing gum and the vegetable glycerin into the distilled water. Mix well. I'm adding my emollient into my distilled water. I'm doing a one pot phase, but you can do a two pot phase like your distilled water separate and your emollient separate, means your water phase and your oil phase. Now I'll be placing it on a electronic stove. You don't need to do this. You can just use a double boiler. But if you want to do this, you need to pay very good attention. You don't want the oil, the butter and the emulsifying wax to get burned. If not, you're not going to get those delicious benefits from the emollient. And also don't forget to use a low setting. 
now our wax is fully melted So now let's add back the water that evaporates while melting the wax. I'm using a egg whisk but if you have a motion blender you can use it So now let's check the temperature of our product. The temperature is 51 Celsius and 123 Fahrenheit. So it's still a little bit high. So now let's recheck our temperature. The temperature is around 32 Celsius and 91 Fahrenheit. So now let's add our cooldown phase. Our next ingredient is our vitamin E oil, which helps stabilize oil and fats in cosmetics products, preventing rancidity. Vitamin E oil is not a preservative. Friends, we just launched our skin and hair care line. So I'll be leaving the website on the description box. So please go check it out. Thank you. Our next ingredient is our preservative. Preservatives are important. They are added to cosmetics to extend their shelf life and prevent the growth of microorganisms such as bacteria, mold, and fungus, which can spoil the product. Please take your time to mix very well so the preservative can combine well with the rest of the ingredients. All right, friends, this is our final product. Please make sure your jar or your bottle is well clean.
All right, friends, I forgot to say this. The cocoa butter I use is unrefined cocoa butter, which is going to give the product a chocolate smell. But if you cannot withstand the chocolate smell, you can just simply use the refined cocoa butter. Before you dip your finger into the jar, please make sure your hands are well clean to avoid any contamination. Alright friends, let's do a test. My hands are so dry and ashy. All right, friends, do not forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. If you have any question, do not forget to drop it on the comment section. I will definitely answer them. All right, guys, stay safe, stay blessed. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.